everyone, welcome back to my Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke! Last time, I defeated Giovanni and have successfully taken care of everything here at Silph Co. This episode, I am gonna be honest with you guys, I am not looking forward to the fight with Sabrina at all. Because as it stands, Jeffro is pretty much my only counter. I have said in the past that Sabrina is gonna spam the ever-loving crap out of... Calm mind. I thought, oh, I'm not gonna have a counter that. But then Jeffro learned Haze, which will eliminate all stat changes among all Pokemon engaged in battle, which means Haze would clear out Calm Mind, provided Jeffro lives long enough to use it. Because I am 95% sure Alakazam is going to outspeed him. Now, I think I mentioned this last episode, but I'm not entirely sure. It's been a little bit. It's been a week, actually. It's the first episode of the recording session today. But I need to get some of the others a bit stronger, you know? I gotta get Jupiter and Yellow J up to level 43 alongside Vinny, who's actually at level 42. I need to get him a bit stronger. On the off chance that Kate, Orville, and Jeffro fall against Sabrina, I need them to be able to take care of this. Really. If worse comes to worse, then they might be my only shot at surviving. But I get the feeling that if they can't... that if... Orville and the others can't take care of Sabrina, then there's a very real chance I'm gonna wipe. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spend some time grinding the other guys. Not Orville, Kate, and Jeffro. Those guys are fine. I'm talking about Jupiter, Yellow J, and Vinny. Because these guys need to get stronger because, like I said, I need them to be ready on the off chance that they, ha they have to fight Sabrina. I hope it doesn't come down to that, but it might. So I'm going to train on those guys right outside Fuchsia again, because I really don't know where else I could go. And I will see you guys in a moment, because this time I'm going to include the grinding session, because hopefully it will not take over an hour. Please do not take over an hour. Oh, please do not take over an hour. <laughs>
Yeah, hell yeah, I'm learning it, but what am I to replace it with? Shit, learning strength seems, seems like a very bad idea now. Okay, okay, tell you what, I'm gonna forget Brick Break for now. I'm gonna go to the department store, go buy another copy, go to the Move Forgetter and Fuchsia, and then get Brick Break back on my thing, basically, because I don't need strength on Finny now. Oh, you little beast, thank you. Thank you so very much. There's still you. You might. Nah. Nah. I'm gonna go. First, I need to make a trip to Fuchsia. There's actually one other thing I think I need to do besides move to leader and all that. Hey, you, sir. I need you to do me a favor. I need you to help me get rid of this move on Vinny. He just learned a greater attack for his horn to use. He doesn't need strength, strength anymore. Please, please get rid of strength. He still has strength, but not that kind of strength. And then I need to remember to get Brick Break back on a mace tap. Okay, so if worse does come to worse, I might have an ace in the hole. But again, I I remember my first test and, test, and I was like, I've always wanted to see a Beedrill try to sweep Sabrina's team, but... Truth be told, I don't know if that's doable. Well, but first things first, I want to go back to the Safari Zone. Not because I want to get Pokemon, don't worry. I already caught everything I could here, but there's a couple items I want to go get. I am 95% sure this is where you get the Quick Claw, so I need to go find that. I think it's back in Area 3 somewhere. So real quick, I'm gonna pick up this item, which I think is a nugget. Yeah, it's a nugget. Good old nugget. Alright, just need to get through here quick. I'm well above how much time. It, it's like 52 minutes, but in the video is probably gonna be cut down to even less because it's gonna be sped up. Is the quick claw over here? It might be. What's this? Let me see. Yep, there's the quick claw. Okay, good. I might need that, that for later. I'm also gonna see what the other items over here that I missed out on were. Yeah, I'm just here to pick up items. What you gonna do? You're probably gonna skip through the video to, to get to where I finally fight the gym. I guess this might take me just a bit longer. This way, pick up the item, which is a max potion, nice. Next, I'm gonna surf back, so I can pick up the item over there on the thing. I guess there's a, oh, nope, never mind. I uh, misunderstood, whoops, whoopsie. Now let's go over here and, Pick it up. It's a leaf stone! Yay! That's only good on raffle, and that's it. Alright, that's all that I want to pick up. All the items I know that I didn't get. Now, for real, let's go back to. Wait. Does this thing in Saffron sell full heals? I might want to stock up on those a bit. Stock up on the full heals and hyper potions. Let's see. Not a revive. I want full heals. Let's get up to 30. There we go. Oh, and um, I want to give you this, if you can give me 5,000 Pokebucks in return. Oh, I have two of them! Yeah! Heck yeah, let's sell that. And that Revive, this X Special I don't need, what else? Oh, I have leftovers, I might want to- Oh, I have some things I could just, you know, put back in my PC. But I'll worry about that later. Right now, I need to get back over to Saffron. Here you go, Vin. I just realized that Yellow Jay can learn that. I don't know, I'm still trying to figure out what to do for Sabrina because I just remembered something. She has a Mr. Mime and I think, I think, I'm not, I don't remember for sure, but I think it knows Miracote. Miracote is the special equivalent of Counter, which means if it were to get hit with a special move, it could very well retaliate by using Miracote, and whoever gets hit will likely die, and that would be Jeffro in this case, considering that he's my main plan against Alakazam. And if he falls, then... I don't know. I, I can't imagine any one of my Pokemon really standing much of a chance. I mean, Kate might. She has Sleep Powder, but then she'd get put to sleep thanks to Synchronize, so I'd have to waste an item bring waking her up. I do know I could use the Poke Flute, but that's a bit of a gray area, I think. I still think that would count as an item. Now, I need to stock up on Hyper Potions first before I do anything else. So let's just... Go ask this cashier, dude. Hey, sir, I want the hyper potions. Please give me 16 of them, if you will. Please and thank you. 
Yeah, yeah, I know. It's a lot of money, but what ifs. Now then, without further ado... Oh, right. I forgot to mention, the civilians are back. Hello. I flew here on my Pidgeot when I read about Sylph. It's over already? Oh, I missed the media action. Dude. Just no. Well, let's go. Hooray. Yo, champ in the making! Sabrina's Pokemon use psychic power instead of force. Fighting Pokemon are especially weak against psychic Pokemon. They'll get destroyed before they can even aim a punch! Hmm... Like, I don't know, I just... I don't know what I should do now, because... If if I'm remembering it right, and that thing does have... And she has Miracote, then... Jeffro has nothing but special moves. If I, Yeah, he's got nothing but special moves, and if he gets hit by a Miracote, chances are he won't survive. Which is why I'm kind of thinking of sacrificing Yellow Jay, and... Like, I don't want to, I really don't want to, but... I don't know if he'll be viable for much longer. Like... I'm happy that he survived this long, because he's the Beedrill that survived the longest, but... I don't... I just... We'll see. Right now I gotta fight these dudes. Sabrina is young, but she's also our highly skilled leader. You won't reach her easily! Oh, believe me, I don't think I will. <laughs> because I also seem to recall that there's a couple of mediums here, channelers, sorry, that might have a Pokemon with Destiny Bond, and that would suck if I lost to Orville to freaking Destiny Bond. Ooh, can, oh, this, well, you're like eight levels ahead. This shouldn't do a whole lot. Yeah, let's just finish it off with Wing Attack. Ugh. I hate feeling anxious. Same kind of bullcrap that happened to me when I played Five Nights at Freddy's all those years ago. Where I got just freaking anxious, anxious and kept saying nonsense. Mind you, this is not the same level, but it's starting to feel that way. We're just scared of what could happen next. And the RNG can be a cruel mistress in this game. Slowbro? Slowbro. I don't think Slowbro knows counter, but this is still gonna take a while because it's... Kind of bulky. How much of this do? That was about 20 damage, I'd say. Let's try fly. See if that does anything, because I think Slowbro can do yawn. It's got headbutt confusion, that's for sure, but what about yawn? Oh, uh, nope, it's doing headbutt. Well, it's still not doing a whole lot of damage. Wing attack should be enough. Bye bye, Slowbro. Gee, Shoreville, you took a beating. Ow! Down and out! Yes, sure. There used to be two Pokemon gyms in Saffron. The fighting dojo next door lost its gym status, though. We simply creamed them when we decided to have just one gym. Wow, you guys sound like a bunch of elitists. Anyway, let's heal. Where's the hyper potions? Oh, I still have supers. That won't be enough to heal Orville all the way, though. He's, he needs 74 HP back. Or 64, sorry. If he were 74, he would have been at yellow. Whoopsie. Okay. There's Chandler Summer here. You understand, don't you? That power alone isn't enough to win in the world of Pokemon. Well, I know, but sometimes you gotta brute force your way through things, and I feel like I may very well need to do that against Sabrina. Mr. Mime! Well, good thing Orville's up front right now. I know, I don't remember. Does Mr. Mime have good special defense or defense? Well, I guess we'll find out. Hmm. Oh. Why are you using Magical Leaf? That only did like nine damage! You fool! Goodbye! You should have tried something else! Kadabra! Alright, well, how much damage will Wing Attack do against Kadabra? Knocked down to one hit, apparently. Hmm, maybe Orville would be my good, the best chance. I don't believe this! I don't either. Actually, I do believe it. Sabrina just wiped out the Karate Master next door. Which teleport did I come in on? I want to try to fight everybody here before I fight Sabrina. Ugh. Okay, how are you doing on health, Thorville? Okay, you're doing fine. Does our unseen power scare you? Your unseen power? Not really. Sabrina's unseen power? Yes. Oh, more Kadabras. Ugh. You know, I kind of wish I got to experience that in this Nuzlocke, but... Oh, well... No Kadabra for me. Uh, well, at least 
Orville's cleaning house, but he's getting close to the level limit. The Orville at the level, level limit might not be a bad idea. Because then he might be able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe against that, uh, Alakazam. Maybe. I still remember Orville's special defense being a bit rubbish. I mean, he might stand a chance, but I'm not sure. God, now part of me is wondering, maybe, maybe for some odd reason that, that Mr. Mime knows counter instead of Frick Fracken Miracote. Maybe it is your defense that sucks. I don't know. I seem to recall Mr. Mime having a good defense. I just can't remember which one. Alright, who's your last Pokemon? Is it another? Yeah, it's another Kadabra. Alright, wing attack, go. Uh, oh, I wouldn't be... Oh, I shouldn't be worried, actually, because you're about to faint. Bye bye I don't know how much damage Future Sight would do, though. I know it doesn't have perfect accuracy. I never foresaw this! Alrighty, then. There's still four more trainers before Sabrina. Let me see if I can get to them. Where am I? Okay, you. Uh, Kate, now might be a good time for you to come in now, because... Fourville's getting close to the level limit, and I want him to be around when I have to fight the channelers. Saffron Pokemon Gym is famous for training psychics. You want to see Sabrina, don't you? I can tell. Uh, yes, I do want to see Sabrina because I need to get the Marsh Badge from her. Thank you very much. Ah, uh, slow bro. Bruh. Mm. Kate, I really wish you learned frickin'... What's that move's name? Silverwind? As it stands, Vinny learned a bug-type move before you did. Maybe you'll learn it later, assuming you get to later, which you might not. Gus is the best you can do right now, though, because... Oh boy, we're gonna be here for the long haul, aren't we? Maybe I should have had Orville stay in, because I just realized Kate could be just as good against the... Oh no, Disable! Too bad that missed. Yeah, Kate could be useful against the Channelers, because they got Ghastly's up the ass. But one of them has a Haunter, and that, that Haunter might know Destiny Bond. That's what I remember, but... Well, memory can be kind of fickle, kind of wrong, kind of messed up, and all that stuff. I know this for a fact, there was a couple things I seem to have misremembered, like the Nidorino Nidorina thing. Oh, Nidorino learns Crunch! No, it doesn't, it learns Flatter for some reason. Nidorina gets crunch. That's it. Stay asleep, slow bro. Come on. Sleepy by nappy time and all that. Come on. Come on. And it woke up. Ah, oh, great. There's the disable. Now it hits. Sleepy, sleepy. Because now I gotta spam Psybeam and that won't go well, I'm sure. Well, it probably... It's definitely not gonna knock it out. But that's all I can do. You're gonna wake up, aren't you? No, you're not. Okay. Good, stay asleep. Oh, well, okay, I guess I'll just blow you away. And I'll stay here in the mess I made. Alright, how much? That'll probably level her up for sure, yeah. There it is. There's her level up. Ah! Why are you getting mad? Calm down. <sighs> That's right. I used telepathy to read your mind. You're scared of Sabrina, aren't you? Uh, okay, here's a channeler. Um, Yeah, it might be my best... I think she- is she the one with the Haunter? Sabrina is far younger than I, but she has earned my respect. Someone in here has a level 38 Haunter and I don't remember who. Maybe it's you. No, maybe not. Yes, Lee. Mm, sleepy, sleepy. There you go. Enjoy the slumber. Please and thank you. Alright. I think one Psybeam ought to be enough to knock you out. Let's see. And yes, it is. Though if you have a Haunter, that's kind of what I'm worried about. A Haunter might survive a Psybeam. Emphasis on might. I don't know. Let's see. Sleepy, sleepy. Sleepy, sleepy. Sleepy, sleepy. And yeah, it's, it's definitely not waking up. What the heck am I trying to say? All right, here we go. The Wub Wub Cannon hitting you in the face. And yeah, it did knock you out in one hit. Yay. Not good enough. What? Me? You? Am I not good enough? I might not be, actually. In a battle of equals, the one with the stronger will wins. If you wish to beat Sabrina, focus and will yourself to victory. Well, that's nice of you. Now to get to the, le to the last two channelers, and here's one of them. Maybe it's you, with the level 38 Haunter. Turn it, then it'll turn on, it's the one right above me. 
Okay, who's that for right now? It's Kate. You and I, our Pokemon shall battle! Well, at least it's nice to see some channelers that aren't possessed. That's a good sign, isn't it? Yeah, it's the one right above me that's the level 38 Haunter. Because, of course. Alright, hit him with the Wub Wubs, Kate! Hey, Kate, maybe you can, like, help Yellow J out with the mixtape thing. Seems like you're doing a good job wub wub wubbing things with Psybeam. As long as you don't do it in Yellow Jay's face, he won't appreciate the wub wubs in his face. This is assuming Yellow Jay is gonna make it out of here in, in this case, because I still have no idea if Yellow Jay will make it out or not. I have no idea if anyone will make it out of this, in all honesty. I mean, I want to say yeah, but this is Sabrina and her really powerful Alakazam we're talking about here. At least she made out of this. I lost after all. Alright, last channeler up ahead. She has a level 38. This is assuming I can figure out where how to get to her because I don't know how the pads of these things right at the top of my head. Okay. Alright, you. Should I get Orville to mm, let me snake. Let me see. Who's got the highest speed between you two? 74, 99, 96, 95. 119.75. Is Jeffro faster than you? He is! Jeffro's faster than you, Butter Kate! Sheesh. Orville, come up front. Pokemon take on the appearance of their trainers. Your Pokemon must be tough then. I hope so. Ooh, I really hope so. Okay. I hope. I hope Orville can outspeed you. Because if he can't, then he's likely getting a destiny bond to the face. And I don't expect Hunter to survive a wing attack, so please, oh please, I'll speed orbit. Thank you! Whew. Yeah, if Hunter went first and used destiny bond, that would have been the end of Orbil right there. I knew it! I hope so. <laughs> I have much to learn still. I must master Psychic and teach it to my Pokemon. Ooh, on a Pokemon like Haunter, that would hurt like hell. Okay, everyone, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go outside and heal real quick, and then I'm going to go and fight Sabrina. So, I will be right back as soon as I figure out how to get out of this maze. Ugh. All right, I'm back. I'm trying to remember the pattern I need to take to get to Sabrina. Um, mm, should I go down? I think think this is right? Yes, it is. Okay, so my plan. Jeffro, it's not, I don't think it's quite safe for you, but you'll be the second one out. If things get really dicey and both Orville and Jeffro die, I'm gonna try sending out Yellow Jay for the twin needle twist thing, because at the very least, if he's able to hit before Alakazam, which I don't know if he will, his speed is 96. We'll have to see. He's certainly faster than Kay. I think he's the second fastest Pokemon I got, actually. Let's see. Well, yeah. Then... No, wait, he's third fastest. I forgot. Jupiter's faster. But, yeah. I... am worried about this. Oh, right! Right, right, right! I almost forgot. Jeffro, I need to give you the Quick Claw. Because you are sure as hell not gonna outspeed Alakazam. So, yeah, it's more RNG things I gotta be worried about, alright? Without further ado, let's go talk to Sabrina. I had a vision of your arrival. I have had psychic powers since I was a child. It started when a spoon I carelessly tossed bent. I dislike battling, but if you wish, I will show you my powers. If you dislike battling, why are you a gym leader then? I mean, that's what gym leaders do. They fight. Also, I see that your psychic aura is more of a golden yellowish color. Hooray, that's a good sign. Alright, first off is Alakazam. It might survive a wing attack from Orville now that I think about it, because if one of them did in the past, we'll see. Might try- Oh no, never mind, she lit- Or he- Or Orville did it. Almost. Who's next? Mr. Mime! Ugh. Okay, let's go for the wing attack. I'm pretty sure this thing's got mirror coat, not counter. Ooh. Wait, that's not bad. Barrier only affects itself. It's not like Reflect. I think Wing Attack should finish it off. Alright, there. That's two down. 
Who's next? Is it another Kadabra? Is it a Hypno? I, I wish I remembered. I know she still has Alakazam, but who's the third Pokemon? Venomoth? Okay. Orville will take care of this, no problem. But of course, then there's the thing. The big issue. The freaking Alakazam that will probably outspeed Orville. Listen, Orville, I if something happens, I'm sorry, okay? I Right now you're you stand the best chance of taking this thing down. So if this thing hits you with psychic, I need you to hold on, okay? Good luck! Oh you outsped it? Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh, it's doing call mine! Okay, wait. She, it might, she might heal this turn. She might. I don't know. Uh, do I quick attack then? Um. Let's quick attack. Yeah, she's gonna heal. Holy shit, this might actually work. This might actually work. Okay, let's see. Quick attack. Oh my god, they did half! Oh my god! Oh my god! Orville! You freaking glorious bird! You, you did it! You didn't even take any damage! This loss shocks me, but a loss is a loss. I admit, I didn't work hard enough to win. Your victory has earned you the Marsh Badge. Oh my freaking god! Orville, you swept Sabrina! I don't believe it! The Marsh Badge makes Pokemon up to level 70 obey you. Stronger Pokemon will become wild, ignoring your orders in battle. Just don't raise your Pokemon too much to avoid that problem. Wait, please, take this TM with you. TM04, call mind if I remember right. Psychic power isn't something that only a few people have. Everyone has psychic power. People just don't realize it. TM04 is Calm Mind. It makes the Pokemon concentrate to raise both special attack and special defense. Oh my god! I... Holy shit! I didn't think that something could possibly top Vinny surviving a self-destruct, but... I think that did it! Orville! You didn't take any damage out there! You swept freaking Sabrina! Oh, okay, okay, it was supposed to go that way. I mean, it's Mr. Mime and Alakazam survived hits from you, but... Holy shit! I... Oh, I'm excited! I, I don't believe this! But I keep thinking that my good luck's gonna run out at some point. Because that's the way things usually go. You have a string of good luck and then something happens to turn it all around. And that thing might be coming up because next up is Blaine. I might actually get to him in this session. I'm not sure. This is still episode, only episode 31. Okay, everyone. That's all the time I got for this episode. In fact, it might be over after the, like, over the time limit after the grinding session. But we'll see. Thank you so much for watching. Next time, I'm going to set sail. So I hope you have a good morning, day or night, wherever you are, and I will catch you later!